Ah, let's see, right about there. As if they weren't happy with the royalty system Gearbox has, they're welcome to quit. Nice. And before we go anywhere else, I'm going to go on a tangent because I fucking hate that. I fucking hate that phrase. We're seeing it a lot right now with the whole coronavirus pandemic. Companies telling their employees they're free to just quit. To landlords telling their tenants they're free to just move. That comes from such a position of privilege and power. From some rich fucking bastards who act as if it's just easy because we're in a free country that if you don't like anything they do and they've given themselves carte blanche to do whatever they want and if you don't like it you can just quit well thank you very much Jim <clears throat> That's bullshit from corporations and the bitches in power. Well, fake power. That they think is real power. But it's not. It's bitches like that. That are the reason I've gone and drawn up this seven page. Just loads just, you know, there we go. Yeah. So what they're doing is intimidating. Especially <laughs> against civilians. Yeah. In the pursuit of political aims. Yeah, they are the terrorists. The, these assholes Jim's talking about. They're, they are the terrorists. Just, I've got a whole fucking uh, load of this shit. And, uh, Jim, yeah, if you want to read this, if you want to glaze over it, I've got a rich text version that I can just uh, fucking email to you. Yeah. Seven whole fucking pages of me basically telling the uh, tyrannical terrorist American organized crime society, fuck you, you're in my way, get the hell out of my way. And this is the perfect time to do it, because they've made their powder keg. Now's just the perfect time to throw a lit match into it and watch them go up with it. And I've thought for over 15 years, contemplated the variables in these equations with and without the application of chaos theory, the Heisenberg uncertainty, uh, uncertainty principle, uncertainty, <laughs> fucking words, I've contemplated, thought about. All the branch pathways this could take. Right now is the perfect time to strike. The iron in the forge is hot. All it requires now is to be molded into the right shape. And the past. This, uh, this bullshit system that Jim's talking about. That Mike from... Uh, Silver and Gold has been talking about, that Peak Prosperity has been going on about, that I've been going on about for 15 fucking years. This corrupt, outdated, terrorist tyranny that you call the American government. It's time for the past to die. Kill it if you have to. And I most certainly aim to kill it. It's a terrorist and a tyranny. To say the very bare bones minimum of what it truly is. And I want to kill it. It's time for it to die. So, the way I see it, it's cut and dry. You're either part of the solution or part of the problem. So get to the left and get to the right, but get the fuck out of my way. 
And yes, you are all in my way. Because I don't see any of you. Jim, Mike, Mr. Prosperity, I don't see any of you fighting against these corrupt scumbags the way you should be fighting against them. Even Louis Rossman, I don't see you drawing up some paperwork like I've done. Telling the government, get the fuck out of my way. You're an outdated piece of shit. You've got all this fucking terrorism and tyranny going on. It's time for you to die. I don't see anyone, and I've never have seen anyone, fight against this terrorist tyranny, organized criminal society of socialite, social justice snowflake fox. I'm not Edward Snowden. I'm not the dude behind WikiLeaks. You're not going to make me go the fuck away. I'm something much more terrible and much more worse. You're not going to make me go away. I promise, I swear to you that, America, I'm not going away. If anyone's going away, the human species will go away, and I will make it go away. I've had enough shit from all of you. I'm not going away. And what's going to happen is inevitable. I've been watching for a very long time, waiting for the perfect opportunity to get rid of these corrupt, terroristic tyranny, fuckwits, scumbags. And this is the perfect opportunity. You're either part of the solution or part of the problem. Jump to the left or the right, but get the fuck out of my way. Hi, right, Jim. If you want to see the that uh, rich text file, provided that my temporary fucking access to uh, Microsoft Word, which never used to be a thing until people let Microsoft become the tyranny and scumbag that it is today. Provided that will still work and I can still email you a copy. <laughs> I'll send you one. You can read that for yourself. But I've already sent a uh, paper copy off to the scumbags who call themselves the Supreme Court Justices. It's time for a change. And it's either going to end very shortly with World War III or it's going to take another five years for World War III. One way or another it's the same ending. I don't see anything different happening after 15 years of thinking about it. If something different happens it'll surprise the living shit out of me. But till next time, fuck right off. <laughs>